are here at the Dam Creek Shelter and campground. It's very pretty up here. Let's look at this shelter for a little bit. This campground was built by the Civilian Conservation Corps probably during the 1930s. A lot of the campgrounds around here were built by the Civilian Conservation Corps. Now where we had just come from, Panther Branch, that was a, a, a logging camp at one time. How pretty it is here. It's rhododendron flowers. Oh, there's Dam Creek. Look at that raging river right there. Oh my goodness. It's going to flood us all. Oh, there's a spider web. I better leave it alone. Across this log. Hope it don't fall off. It's very green. It's been a long time since I've last been out here. Oh, what's that? Oh, it's like that little, I don't know if that's a grill or, let me look at it. Oh yeah, it's like a little, I don't know if they, if it was a trash can or some sort of the, the bin where you put your waste and stuff. There's one up there. I think actually that's where um, you could put your food and stuff to keep away from the bears. I think that's what that is. Now, technically speaking, this wouldn't be an abandoned site, but I would consider it to be historic based on the fact that it was built by the Civilian Conservation Corps. And they did, they had built a lot of things here in the Teleco Plains side of the Cherokee National Forest. Like I said, I've not been to Dam Creek, or at least this campground, in years. too far. I like this little bridge. I like these little bridges. It looks like a set of fire or something there. Pretty little waterfall. There's a little trail. I don't know if there's any more. Yeah, there's a another campfire there. Oh, this was a, uh, a water fountain. I remember when there was still running water up here. I'm trying to remember if the bathrooms that they had up here, I don't I don't remember if I don't think they were actual bathrooms. I think um, they weren't porta potties either. I'm trying to think what they call those. Um, more or less like outhouses, except they, they actually have water and they're shaped more like a toilet. Let's see if I get a picture of that. Oh, it didn't turn out good, but oh well. I bet that's actually a little storage thing. But you could put your food to hide from bears. ripped off of it. I don't know if anybody's camped here in a while. Something tells me they haven't because these look like they haven't been used in a while. Like I said, I wouldn't go so far as to say this campsite is abandoned, but it really looks like nobody has been here for a while. I mean, there's new trash cans over there. They're bear-proof. 
I love all these ferns. That's another sign too. Temperate rainforest is all the ferns and moss. This one also has the doors. It's been ripped off too. Because that would not, if it was a little storage place that you would put your food or your supplies to keep away from bears, I would think that they'd still keep the doors. And you could tell it's not been used in a while. There's like something has built a nest in there. A little branch. That little that moss. I like the way that moss looks. Right there is a campfire. It's where you could put a I got a grill there. And judging by how wet everything is you can't really tell when the last time anybody camped up here was. Honestly, the times that I've been here on Dam Creek, I really don't see very many people out here. Because also, it's not too far away from Green Cove, so a lot of people would rather camp at the Green Cove. There's a, actually little cabins that's there. There's a motel that's up there has all the, you know, creature comforts, and unfortunately, there's a lot of these people that don't want to wing it, I'll take, well, I can't, there's a glare on there, but better head back down, because we will be going to Green Cove, I would like to hike up here a little bit more, some other time maybe, if it's not you know, it was rainy or muggy. Let's see, this is what... There's the airproof trash can. Anybody's been here? Nope, nobody has been here. Look at the other one. Oh, nobody's been here for a while. Truck. There's our truck down there. Oh. Oh, there is another table with one of those little um, storage things. I do know there's a hiking trail. There's probably more little campsites here. Okay, now, if you wanted to do abandoned campgrounds, there are several in the City Co Creek Wilderness area. And that's actually kind of a popular place for people to go around here. I like going up there because it's really pretty. It's uh, secluded. pit, picnic table, another one of those little structures, 
Looks like nobody's used that one in a while either. And there has been a problem with bears here lately. Um, because of the drought, the bears are having to come out of the mountains and down into the valley to actually find food. Matter of fact, there was a bear, there was a picture of a bear that was posted online of one crossing the street in Athens, Tennessee. It's actually near the hospital. There's been some um, bear attacks in the Smokies lately. Yeah, look at that. Well, this one doesn't have moss on it. Not yet, anyway. I said that's, this is very pretty out through here. Surprised I haven't seen any rangers out here today. I'm wondering if they even venture out or maybe they're making sure the more popular areas are kept under control. It's actually another campground with ruins of the Civilian Conservation Corps. Um, actually, I guess the barracks where the guys stayed at. I'm trying to remember exactly where it was at. I'd like to go back up there too to get some shots of the ruins. door open because we weren't going to go very far. I have so many videos to upload tonight. My internet's been really slow lately. Look at these walls here too. They built. was built too by the CCC. There's actually a similar walk, rock wall that's over at Bald River Falls underneath the bridge, which they also built that bridge too. on over to Green Cove and the state line. Hopefully we'll be able to and I'm absolutely starving right now and thank goodness my IBS has not acted up today. I'm so grateful for that. He's still up there at the shelter. But I'm going to get off here and we're going to go up the river a piece to see what it looks like there.